Mika and today we are going to be doing a review on our new test mat we got for our new Tesla Model Y. Um, this is not affiliated with test mat in any way, we just wanted to get one to try it out so we can go camping in our Tessie. I really like that the test mat fits in your back trunk nook or you can put it in the front, whichever is easier. It's also pretty lightweight, I'm weak and I can lift it so. And one of the most important parts is you have to let it expand. So we're gonna, here's our test sheets. We're gonna let this expand for a couple minutes and poof up while we get the back set up. So to start, we're gonna start by dropping our seats. I love how fast this is. It only takes one or two minutes tops and this is the Model Y specific so it fits perfectly. There's four pads and the top one, this goes on the bottom at the top so we have space up here for our heads. <laughs> they also have Velcro, which attaches really easily together, so you can make one giant bed. Next we take out our sheets. There's a bottom sheet, a top sheet, and a pillowcase in this, which is super nice. But I do recommend getting two pillows. We tested this out and it's a little flat. So it just goes around like a normal bed. And for a better grip, you're going to want to put it around the seat underneath. Then you can just keep any extra stuff on the sides. You can still access this, which is nice. And we have a testing bed. Uh, ow. <laughs> <sighs> okay, I'm getting in here now too. So I'm six foot three. So I'm a good uh, size comparison here. And as you can see, even here, I can fully stretch out. My head goes right to the tip and even fully stretched out. And it's a comfy material, right? Yeah, it's, it's like a memory squishy. foam or something. It's super it's comfy. It's pretty thick. The only thing again is I would say two pillows because when we tested it, it's really flat. At least for me, I, I need like extra volume. Make sure you have a blanket wide enough for however many people are under this because we brought a blanket that fit perfectly, but take into account that the depth of a body. <laughs> okay, is it time to pack it up? Yep. Okay, and now to take it all apart, we just reverse everything. We're gonna pull off the fitted sheet first. Oh, I can't, oh, there. I can't. This is even faster with two people. I'm not helping at all here. Do you ever? <laughs> <laughs> Touche. Um, you can fold it up or you can just throw it to the side for now, which I'm gonna do. And then you just undo the Velcros. Take hold. And now we just squish it in. We put the wood side down so it has some support. And for the top, you want the wood to be on the top as well. 
That's a little sandwich. Okay, so now we're gonna try to squish it all down in here and latch it up. I have never tried this before. Ugh. So, <laughs> see if I can. I don't think I have enough body weight. You're doing good. It's normally That's my job. That's as far as it goes. Yep. Let's see if we can get the strap together. Okay. <laughs> No, <laughs> I don't have enough body weight. <laughs> <laughs> this might be a daddy job. Yeah, huh? this is definitely, I give up. Okay, you can take over. Okay, so this you do need a little strength for, so we'll throw that in the review. I always do this part, it's not hard, um, but it makes it easier if you have some body weight. So, I'm gonna pop it on down here, and then you just kneel on it. And then these two, you just gotta, Whoops, I didn't give it enough room, but they just connect like that. So, if you have a little bit of body weight, if she was doing this solo, it'd probably be hard, but for me, it's really actually a fantastic design. Super easy, throw in the sheets, throw it in the back, and we love the test mat, right? Yeah, I, think we I love, love it. it. It was great, we tested it out, and yeah, it was awesome. Highly recommended. Now we're gonna pop it in the front. I love that this has a front trunk. Like look at all this extra space. Okay, thank you so much for watching. If you like this, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel because we're brand new. And you can come along with us on all of our new Tessie adventures. And we also like cooking a lot, so they'll probably be that too. So yeah, thanks for watching.